must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys. Whoa, hi, oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today as always. Hope you're all having a great day wherever you guys might be. So, we are at Hateno Ancient Tech Lab right now. And the reason for that is I want to explore up here along the east coast today. This is episode 54, I think, and uh, we're going to explore Mount Laneru a bit, and uh, if we have more time, then we're going to keep heading up north, and eventually I want to explore these islands, because even though I've beaten the game twice, this is my third playthrough, I've never actually been to those islands. I don't know why, I just never went there. Um, anyways, this great epic ice land up here is where we're gonna go uh, you know what it's been a while since we've done a bomb launch i wonder if i can launch over there i might be able to do it like right here it might be a little bit too high but we'll see all right here we go guys ready set it's actually easier now that I have so much stamina. Woo, baby! And actually, we're gonna have to equip our uh, snow quill set. Unfreezable. Plus, I have the uh, the fire sword, which I don't even actually need to have that equipped. Let's equip this sea breeze boomerang. It looks so cool. Man, we got over here fast. Also, um, I want to be looking for shrines over here, so I'm going to turn this on. I believe there's a shrine somewhere around here. And look at that, we already have one picked up. The shrine, there's a shrine somewhere around here that has the, uh, the climbing boots. So that's what I'm looking for. I don't remember exactly where it is, so... Okay, now the shrine sensor not really... Okay, somewhere this way. Well, we'll we're just exploring, guys. We'll find it. I bet you the shrine is like in the cliff or something. Would not surprise me. Ooh, I see a rush room. Oh, look at that. Easy! Oh my goodness, I didn't even know it was there, I promise. <laughs> I just landed. Oh. Well, hello, sir. Gotta fight ice with fire, you know what I mean? Grab all that good uh, wild berry, those chill shrooms. Alright. I was thinking, you know, like. We still have quite a bit of the game left. Like, I do have all the towers, and I did do uh, Divine Beast of Abrudania, but we still have three other Divine Beasts to do, and a ton of shrines and other quests to complete. And I was just thinking, it would be nice if I got the full climber set sooner rather than later. I know there's uh, some of you been really wanting me to get that, and I think this is the shrine. I could be wrong. If it if it's not this shrine, I know it's a shrine somewhere in this region. Oh look at that! Just a blessing. All right, kind of boring. I was hoping for an actual, you know, challenge, a puzzle. Come on, Nintendo. I haven't had a good shrine in a while. Hey, we got the climbing boots. Oh man, that is hype. We have the full climbing set. That makes me so happy. Oh man. Also, I want to. Uh, Go to the Great Fairy Fountain and upgrade it if we can. I need to get more rush rooms though. 
Also, now that I have a, another spirit orb, we can complete our second wheel of stamina. Which means pretty soon I'm going to do the sword trial to upgrade the master sword. I'm going to do that soon. Momo's playing Animal Crossing, it looks like. Probably because today is July 1st, which means if you play Animal Crossing, it's exciting because that means there's new bugs, new fish, and just new stuff going on every month. So it's one of the things about that game that makes it kind of fun. So let's take a look and see what the full climbing set looks like. Link's a little bit cold, but there you go. Yep. Okay. Uh, let's go back to the snow quill set so I don't freeze to death. All right, uh, I, I feel like I want to explore a little bit more. Let's go to the top. The tippity top of Mount Laneru. I'm going to put a red... Actually, let's do the blue marker up there, just so I can see it on my map. Let's make our way up to the tippity top of this mountain and see what's up there. If my memory is right, guys, you will be amazed at what is at the top of this mountain. It is truly something memorable and amazing. But I don't remember if it's this mountain or a different one. Man, I do wish I had the snowshoes because I walk so dang slow. Oh, really? Really? We got an ice wolf, guys. You know what that means. Time for some wolf on wolf. I choose you! Zumwar! Spirit wolf! Go! Use your bite! Bite for eight damage. Bite for seven damage. He's critically wounded. Oh, Ice Wolf has fainted. Thank you for that raw gourmet meat. Very nice, very nice. Actually, while we're here, guys, it's only fitting that we, we try to get Daruk's champion mask. This is day four of trying to get the mask. And we're going to do it in the Iceland. <laughs> Even though he's a Goron. Watch me get the, the, the Goron champion mask in the complete frozen wasteland. If I get it right here, guys, it's going to be awesome. What it is, is the Divine Beast Varudanya's mask. It's not actually Daruk, it's the Divine Beast mask. We have a chance. Here we go. Day four. Ah, we didn't get it. We didn't get it. Dang it. Uh, I don't need two boomerangs. I don't even remember when I picked that up. I'll take another Stone Smasher, though, Daruk. They're always nice, I guess. Would rather get the uh, Champion's Mask. I've never, ever had a Champion's Mask before. Because I never had the Champion Amiibos before. Dang, I wish I could use the full climbing set, but I'd be too cold, I think. Maybe if I wore the uh, Flame Sword, I don't have to, but I don't know. All right, we're just gonna keep climbing up this massive, massive mountain. It's like Mount Everest over here. I don't know if this is the tallest mountain. Probably not as tall as Death Mountain, but it is, it's pretty tall. It's probably not even as tall as Dueling Peaks. And that's another area I do wanna revisit because there is two shrines at the Dueling Peaks. One down below and one up top. And I got the one down below, but I never got the one up top. And uh, I just remember there's one up top because I remember we could see it from, uh, from the, actually from the Hateno Ancient Tech Lab. You could see the shrine on the top of the Dueling Peaks uh, mountain. So, man, this is, this is, ooh, another wolf, another wolf battle. Let's get some more gourmet meat, man. Don't bother me. I'm trying not to use as many arrows. I, I figured out why the shops are not restocking arrows, guys. I, I looked it up. If you have more than 50 arrows, they won't restock it. Of any kind of arrow. And, uh, yeah, I have 76. That's why they won't restock. So I can only get arrows from monsters if I have more than 50. Ooh, the music changed, guys. This just got interesting. All right, we found the path up the mountain. You guys are gonna be amazed at what's up here. Get him, Wolf. Get him, Wolfie. Ooh, what a, 
That was a big, uh, kind of an ice block. Nice. I don't really have a lot of white chew jelly. Yeah, that was literally all I have. So, and I need it to upgrade some certain armor, so. I mean, I, I hardly ever use fire arrows, right? So. You're not a, uh, you're not a frost lizard, okay. Knight's Claymore. Eh, I think I'm good on that. I wish I could keep the fire sword out just because it, it works well in this area. Ooh, wolf. Can... Zumor, can you get those bats? I don't want to use my arrows. Get him, get him, get him. He's trying. Got him with that spin attack. These are these are kind of ra wolf. Where where'd you go? Ooh, that's actually ore. I didn't even notice. Luminous stone. Maybe I should be here at night. Like I could probably find the luminous stone easier. Oh hi. Might as well use the master sword. I mean, I have. It's the only weapon that I have that recharges, so it's basically unlimited use. Thank you, thank you. I hardly ever come to icy regions, it feels like, so getting these ice chew jellies and ice wings and ice lizzo false tails is actually really, really good. Go get him, Wolfling. Go get him. Could even use this. Now we got a lot of them. That's actually a good boomerang. That's actually the best boomerang that I got. It's even better than this one. Alright, let's see how long this long throw works. Not really that long. Let's take the, the boomerang, man. That, that's a nice boomerang. It's also just a good one-handed weapon. A little bit short range, but it's okay. I like using the Master Sword to break ore because, like I said, it just recharges. So you can break ore for free. Oh man, guys. What is at the top of this mountain? I know what's up here. And it's amazing. Ooh, cutscene. Good time to take a sip of tea. That is a dragon that has been corrupted and possessed by a parasite. And we must free the dragon. You have done well to find your way to this spring. You who have overcome numerous trials and obtained the spirit orbs. Speaking of, I do need to get more stamina. The one you see before you is an attendant to the Spring of Wisdom. This is Nadra, the blue spirit of the Nehru. This servant of the goddess has looked over the spirits of this land for ages unknown to the world of man. However, the dreaded malice unleashed by Calamity Ganon has possessed its body and reduced it to this state. Aw oh man, Nadra has been on sucking... This parasite's been sucking Nadra's brain for a hundred years. You have received the spirit orbs. Free Nadra from this malice. Show what power you can achieve. Ooh. Big eyeball. Um, I will do that, but first can I get the stamina? Hold on, Nadra. Just... Give me one second here. Oh, oh. Never mind. Alright, first things first. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're about to go on an adventure, boys. You ready?
just gotta wait and see where she goes. Do I gotta go up top? Going up. Dang, I love the bluish purple. hit that. We must follow Nedra to free her spirit. Free her body. Dang, how cool does that look, guys? so hard to hit that thing. There we go. Oh no, my stamina. Nedra, I'm trying to help you. Come on, give me some wind gusts. Help me out. Come on, Nick. There we go. There's only one more left, and it's like... Kinda hard to get. You gotta hit the small ones. Oh man, Nader's like hitting the ground. She's suffering. But yet she also knows she's almost free. There we go. We did it! She's free! Now we will see her true form. Even more purpley than before. Oh, wait for it, wait for it. Oh, the ice dragon is free, finally. Actually, I kind of liked it before, the colors, but that one looks cool too. Dang, wasn't that epic, guys? We got to fly with dragons. Or a dragon, flying with dragons. Flying with the dragon. Thanks to your efforts, Nadra, the spirit of Mount Lenadra has been freed from the grips of evil power. But a single ceremony remains. Now, loose your arrow through the body of Nader to free the spirit. Yeah, you literally want me to shoot her in the face. I don't understand it, but okay. What if I didn't have any arrows left? Hey, what about my scale? That is the Spirit Nadra scale. It fell when you struck the arrow. It serves as proof of your courage you received from the one who served the spring since ancient times. Come, offer a scale. Alright, I just got this epic rare thing and now I have to uh, drop it. Is that a shrine? Oh man, I forgot you get a shrine too. 
All right. I thought I was just going to be able to pray. Your path has shown itself. Now go forth. Epic. I think there's other shrines like this too, where you have to offer scales of different dragons. Oh, I can't even pray until I do the shrine. Come on, man. Jitan Sa Mi Shrine. Is it going to be another blessing? I hope it's not. It probably is. Yup. I guess freeing the dragon was, you know, hard enough. It wasn't that hard, but, you know. Alright, that's a good weapon. It's actually a really good weapon. When you're, like, surrounded by enemies, a frost spear is super useful because it's so fast. Um, I have a lot of really good weapons. It's a really good sword, but this is more useful. You don't just find a frost spear laying around every day. You know what I'm saying? Those royal swords, they drop off like the silver bokoblins and the golden bokoblins. We find those guys all, all the time. But you don't find a silver spear very often. Or, I mean, a, <laughs> a silver spear would be awesome, actually. Uh, a frost spear. All right. Now, may I pray at the statue? She really wanted me to get that reward first. I wasn't actually planning on doing this uh, part of the game uh, quite yet, but I'm happy we did. I, I feel bad when there's a, tr a dragon anywhere in the world that's trapped by parasites. You know, we just freed one of the spirits of the... What are the guardian spirits of this world, basically? So... That, that just swings the balance a little bit more in favor. And, and less so, uh, you know what I mean, for Ganon. Alright, now I can do it. Alright, stamina. Our first second wheel of stamina. Our first second wheel of stamina. <laughs> you can actually get three full wheels, which is what I'm going to go for, obviously. But then I'll go for hearts after I get three full wheels of stamina. Beautiful. Now that I have two full wheels of stamina, guys, I feel a little bit better about doing the sword trials because the reason for that is you gotta do a lot of bullet time stuff to, to do well, I feel. And, um, you know, you need a lot of stamina for that. Plus, the second sword trial, you're like flying half the time, so. All right, where are we? Um, Let's go check out the Nadra Snowfield. I don't know what, like, is over here, but I wanna check out the Nadra Snowfield. Actually, didn't we just go down there? That's like where the dragon was flying. Maybe I won't go down that way. Let's just explore. We still have time in this episode. I'm, I'm going to explore this ice region and just see what we find. Might find another shrine. Who knows? I would love to. I mean, I would love to actually have a shrine that's a challenge. I kind of wish that every single shrine in the game was a challenge. I don't, I don't really like any of them being blessings. Or maybe just like very rarely would one be a blessing if you did something really, really deserving. But even then, I don't like it. I don't like it. Hey, look at that, we did find a shrine. All right, let's go to that one. Awesome, it's like way down here. All right. See? You just never know what you're gonna find when you explore. I, my goal in this game is to complete all 120 shrines. So, any shrine I see, I have to do. Just gonna summon back uh, Wolfie Boy. Where'd my boomerang go? That's the only thing about boomerangs, man. They're always getting lost. I don't even see where it went. Alright, really, bro? Alright, well, I guess I got a Knight's Claymore. Where did it go? Did it fly off the cliff somewhere? I bet you it did. Oh, there it is. What do we have here? Ooh.
something, uh, just an ice block. Let's just chill here for a second. I saw there was some monster parts that I, I needed to pick up or something down there, but oh well. I think they disappeared. Is there anything in this ice block? Oh, look at all those luminous stones up there, guys. I kind of want to go up the mountain. There's more ice blocks up there to melt, too. I could swing the weapon to make it go faster, but then I think the durability gets hit, so I don't really want to. Yeah, I think you're right, Wolfling. Time to take another sip of tea. Ah, so how you guys doing today? Any of you guys enjoying some uh, beautiful fresh tea while you watch? Maybe uh, water? Maybe soda? Hmm. Yeah, there's the Nadra snowfield down there. It definitely looks like there's probably stuff down there. That looks interesting. There's actually ruins there. Some kind of pathway. Very interesting. Alright, this thing is almost gone. Can I just stick the sword right in there? Just stick it right in there. Make it melt faster. Any minute. Are you telling me there was literally nothing in this? This takes a little bit longer than, than it should, I mean. There's nothing. That's disappointing. Wait a minute. Oh, thank you. It wasn't a waste of time. <laughs> I was like, did we just waste five minutes watching ice melt? I do want to uh, go up there. Should I go up? Or should I go down to the shrine? I think down to the shrine is easier. We can always go down. It's harder to go up. Let's go up first, and then we'll go down to the shrine. After. I guess I could equip at least one piece of climbing. Maybe even two. Oh yeah, I can get away with two. Because I got the flame sword equipped. So much stamina. I don't know where all those luminous ores went because I can't see anymore. Oh, okay, here we go. Uh, Master Sword. I'm a little bit cold now. Alright. Let's keep ascending. This mountain is really tall. Ooh. More luminous stone. These are 70, 70 rupees each, guys. We're getting rich. Oh man. Do I got a cobble crusher? I guess not. Whoa, I guess you can't, uh... Oh my! Nadra came back! Nadra came back. Quick, let's go to the top. Hey Nadra, can I get another scale please? Far. Nedra. Hey, remember me? 
I freed you from like eternal torment. Hey. Can I get one of the scales? Yes! Thank you! And it's towards the shrine, you're amazing! Don't ask me what happened there, guys. No, 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 I want the mushroom. I was trying to like surf down here, but it just oh wow, it ended right next to the uh, right next to the sword. Thank you, Nadra. You're amazing. I love you. All right, go back, go back home now. All right, where is this shrine? Oh, actually, we are at time, guys. We are at time. All right, guys. That's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did. As always, guys, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next episode. This was a really fun one. There she goes. Next episode, guys, we're going right here. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy.